you guys today is currently thursday the 31st of august and it's currently 11 o'clock so i'm off work today because i'm going to my college enrollment which starts at 12 um so i've just got ready and i'm about to leave out in a couple of minutes so this is what i'm wearing i've just got this um striped shirt on i've got some black leggings and i have this choker on and these are all from Primark and then I have my bracelets which are also from Primark and then I'm wearing my Pandora bow ring and my Pandora classic elegance ring. My hair is a bit different as well so let me know what you think of it in the comments. It's more of a brown tone than the blonde. It is still kind of blonde-ish but it's more of a brownie blonde if that makes sense seems to be showing up quite brown on camera so i'll let you guys know how it goes at the college what i get back so i'm back home now and it's good news i got a place at the college i'm so excited i will be starting um not next week but the week after on monday which is the 11th so i got my id card and i got my picture taken it looks so bad like it looks terrible um we got our picture taken at like the front desk with a little webcam so i was at the college for like three hours i was there for ages and i've got a headache at the moment and i just need some sugar so i'm gonna make myself a cup of lemon tea and then i'm going to touch up my makeup a little bit i'm going to film my back to school haul i'm just gonna call it a back to school haul because these stuff you can use for college um school university you know i've just got some stuff over here in the box um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and get on with that so i'm going to kent tomorrow i don't think i've told you guys but i'm going to kent tomorrow which is friday i do have work tomorrow but i've informed work that i'm not going to be going in so i'm gonna end today's vlog here and i will speak to you guys at some point tomorrow so hello you guys it's sometime after five o'clock so i'm bare faced right now because i just couldn't be bothered to put any makeup on today so i've just come back from the doctor i went to see them about the marks on my face so i've got one dot here and one dot here they appeared like last year and i just never went to the doctors about it i got some cream for it so i have to use that twice a day for the next seven days so the main reason why I went to the doctors is because I have a lump on my neck I don't know if you can see it but I need to go to the hospital whenever I can to get a blood test to rule out blood cancer and then I have to do like another step after that just so that they can figure out what the lump is the cupcake is awake at the moment this is what she does when she wants to be picked up and sometimes she literally runs up to where you are it's so cute so i'm actually going to kent again today i normally go every two weeks um the taxi guy is late so he said he's gonna be an hour late so i'm just gonna chill out for the next 40 minutes to an hour but i've got everything ready so when he's downstairs i can just go and put my shoes on so i thought i'd do a really quick outfit all today so everything i'm wearing is from primark I've got these black leggings on I've got this cropped jumper on which you guys have seen so many times so because i'm going to be away for a few days i'm going to give the hamsters some extra food i will be back on sunday so i'm only really going to be gone for one whole day um but hello cupcake but i normally like to give them some extra food anyway just so that they don't oh are you biting me that is not very nice cupcake really are you not going to be friendly no okay so what i like to do when i'm away is i just check to see how much water they have um this should be enough water to last them for three days um let me check on cashmere's water yep she's got more than enough water and then i'll change it on the sunday when i'm back i'm not actually sure where cashmere is right now but she's sleeping somewhere i'm just gonna chuck in some of the science selective pellets and the jr farm dwarf hamster mix which i'm running out of i'm so low on this um i go through these quite quickly i'm not sure if i have another bag packed away somewhere but i hope i do so the best thing to do especially when you're going away is just to scatter the food around the cage that way they can sort of walk around and go and pick it up themselves and i'm just going to do the same for cupcake but cupcake will pick up her food quite quickly and store it somewhere cashmere just tends to sort of leave hers and eat when she's hungry whereas cupcake as soon as she sees food she's like all over it i'm just going to scatter cupcake's food all around the cage and she's going to have fun 
picking this all up. So I've got my bag all packed and ready to go. So I'm just going to be on my laptop for the next hour until the taxi guy arrives. So I'm just going to be editing my website because I've got a lot of work to do. And now I'll have my website linked down below in the description. What with Dumbledore gone, said Fred, Filch was best viewed at a distance. The head mistress would like to see you, Potter. Fred, who was taking orders from clamoring Gryffindor's unglass spheres. Much. Something he wanted, or somebody else wanted. So the taxi's here now, I'm just gonna go and head downstairs. So I'll speak to you guys again when I'm in Kent. Charlie's house and we are having um, takeaway and it's just arrived. How do you know what's what? Everything's just in a bag. What? Oh. Uh. Um, <laughs> they could at least label them. Is that mine? Is that mine? Oh my gosh. That is. Mine and yours? Yeah. Okay, so that's yours. Savaloy and I've got two buttered sausages. And I also have some nuggets. Charlie! Say hello. Hello guys! So I've just had my dinner and I'm now going downstairs because there's a cat and I love animals. Oh it's so cute. Hi Gwen. Good to see you it is. How did you even recognise it? Easy to tell. What's that? Is that a cat? There's That's another cat. cousin's cat. Yeah. Yeah. So, good morning, you guys. Me and Malika are both ready. Um, just trying to decide where we're going first. I think, I believe we're going to the post office first. Um, there's Malika. I'm so little. <laughs> I'm about over six foot. So, yeah, that's... Why my lake is very little. And I'm what, five, five foot tall? Yeah. Going to the post office because she needs to send our two parcels for her business. Um, then we have town, Primark. Pandora. Yeah, she wants to go to Pandora. Didn't do anything. Um, but yeah, obviously I'm taking her to Nando today because she's been talking about it all week and... No, oh. for, the, for, for the past month actually. Yeah, past month and it turns out I've got to pay as well. Yeah, but that's because I paid for Chinatown. Yeah, she paid for Chinatown. And there's me mum! And she's hiding, she's camera shy. We're just off to the post office and um, the few clips before Charlie stole my camera and decided to do some vlogging for himself so I would have inserted those clips already. So I've just got two of my parcels to post off so we're just heading down to the post office and then we're gonna go back to Charlie's and then head off to town. It's a bag tag. Just the elder wand and Harry's wand. Oh, Hermione's wand. I've never actually seen the wands in person though. But they wouldn't have one that I want. <laughs> It's a nice bracelet. Well, it does say on the back that black symbolises happiness. So me and Charlie are in Nando's at the moment. We're just having some lunch. So Charlie got chips, the butterfly chicken breast and coleslaw with a Coca-Cola. 
and I got the butterfly chicken breast with chips and peri peri sauce and corn on the cob and then I have a lemonade very nice What about the lemon? What about the lemon? Give it a bit of flavour. So we finished eating now. Charlie completely cleared his plate. He's really, really good. So we've just left Nando's and we're going to go back into the shopping centre to go to Candy Inc. Oh yeah, I remember your vibe. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not here. I love this shop. She likes that. What, your mum? Yes. Oh look. These are the ones I've had, but not in this box though. Oh, do you remember these? Childhood. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're just in shoe zone at the moment and I've seen these shoes so I'm just trying them on. We're back from town now and I've just got changed. I need to go ahead and take my makeup off. I'll show you guys everything that I got today at the end of the vlog. Charlie got this chocolate thing from Candy Ink. For 50 um, pence. How is it? Dry. Charlie also got um, these chewing gums and the sour sweets. Mm -hmm. When are you going to try this? Charlie also got another one of these Arizona drinks. This is in the flavour fruit punch. Really nice. Can I try one? Have you tried it yet? No. Me and Charlie are going to try one of these extreme sour sweets. They're like rainbow chewy things. Let me get one out. They're probably not even that sour. Pizza is finally here. Is it exactly the same as last time? Did you get your mum's salad? So, salad, mom's mozzarella salad. sticks, cookies. That's yours. My pizza. Thank you, Charlie. Your mum's pizza. Which is the alligator? What pizza did you get? Maybe and this is Charlie's the large. pizza. So before I forget, I'm just going to end today's vlog here. So it's just after 10 o'clock and we're going to be watching a scary movie. Um, are you going to say good night? Good night, guys. Yeah. So I'll speak to you guys tomorrow. So morning you guys, um, Malika is currently still in bed, she's still half, half asleep, she's lazy. We're not really going to be going out or anything today, um, probably chilling and relaxing, watching Harry Potter, some scary films on Netflix, it's good the morning her. I've not been awake. So hello you guys, it's currently Sunday and it is just after 3 o'clock so Charlie took my camera this morning and filmed whatever, I'm not too sure what he filmed yet because I won't know until I'm editing this video um, but me and Charlie have been watching some films on Netflix, we watched The Human Centipede and then we watched The Human Centipede 2 and that film is so messed up. So we're just eating lunch now, we're just having the rest of our pizza from yesterday, what are we going to watch on? After. Human centipede three. Really? Okay. Then we're gonna watch the human centipede number three. But I don't think I'm gonna be doing much for today. Really, just watching films until I go home. Good evening, you guys. Um, just a quick update. Probably gonna be the last time you see me for a little while, as uh, Malika is currently packing her stuff because she's due to be getting picked up in half an hour. All you YouTube lot, you can tell me uh, Malika make a brilliant team. And she's in a good mood. So I'm home now, it took about an hour to get back. 
um, it went really really quick. I'm just going to unpack my stuff, wash my face and then get into bed because it is um, like after 10 o'clock now and I have work tomorrow and I need to be up at 5.30. So I'm going to give you guys a haul of all the items I got on Saturday tomorrow when I get back from work. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the rest of the video. So I've not long got in from work. I think it's about 6.30 so I apologise for the light in this video so it's actually tuesday i was gonna film this yesterday but when i got home i couldn't be bothered so i went into shoe zone um i don't go to shoe zone often sometimes they do have some really nice shoes and their shoes do tend to last for a very long time as well and i must say i'm not really a shoe person i'm not that kind of girl that goes crazy for shoes i'm more of a bag person i hunt around for really cute handbags um and i really like clothes as well but for shoes i'm not so fussed about them i do have quite a few pairs of shoes but i tend to wear like the same ones again and again and again until they're like dead but i saw these and i thought these were really cute so i tried them on in store and they just look amazing on so they're just these ankle high boots and they're like wedges but they're super super comfortable and they're just so cute and so me the only thing i dislike about them is the fact that they are suede and these are gonna get really dusty and really dirty um other than that i love them so i went into primark as usual and surprisingly i didn't pick up any clothes because I didn't see a single thing that I liked. But the main reason why I went into Primark was to get some bed sheets. And I've needed to get some new bed sheets because I literally have one bed sheet which matches my new room. All of my other bed sheets were hot pink and obviously that doesn't match my new room anymore because it's now light pink and white. So I've been on a hunt for some bed sheets for ages and I just hadn't seen any that I liked but I managed to find a plain one oh well sort of plain one in Primark I don't particularly love it but the like wasn't anything else so first of all I got this pink fitted sheet I'm not sure if the colour is shown up properly but um it's more like a light pink with a hint of like a peachy colour and this is the duvet set that I got it's just white and then it's got like um stripes going down it not sure how well you'll be able to see it so i went into the pound shop and charlie got me um everything that was in the pound shop because he was getting some stuff as well and then he was just like pick up whatever you want so i picked up this little acrylic heart and it opens up it's like a little organizer thing um i'm not sure what i'm gonna put in this just yet i'm not really a jewelry person um but i do like to wear my two pandora rings and i do love my chokers so the things that i wear the most i sort of keep them in the little candle jar um so i thought this would be a little bit better it's just a really nice acrylic heart and the last thing i got from the pound shop were these um fairy lights i honestly don't need any more fairy lights i have like 20 different fairy lights and i don't even use half of them but these ones are really really pretty they're like silver vintagey shabby chic looking hearts um and yeah i'm really excited to, to put these in my room i don't know where i'm even going to put them so we also went into wilco and i picked up another charger um because the one i got um two weeks ago is broken because i dropped my ipad from my bed onto the floor and um it like bent the charger and it wasn't charging properly so i thought i would go ahead and pick up another one um this was only like four pounds something this is the lighting up one the charger isn't in the box right now the next thing i got from wilco were two of these mechanical pencils and it comes with like refills for the lead so i thought this was great because i am going to college and i already have one mechanical pencil but i thought it would be great if i had like some more and the fact that it came with refills is really good but the last thing i got from wilco was something for my hamsters this is mainly for cupcake because cashmere doesn't really like these too much um but i got a pack of these millet sprays and um cupcake loves these cupcake loves anything with seeds in it this is probably one of her favorite treats so the next shop we went into was candy ink which is a sweet shop so last time me and charlie went into candy ink he brought everything so this time i decided to buy stuff for me and him i picked up two of these jolly rancher drinks this one is strawberry it's really really nice um it's not like any other drink i've tasted before um and the bottle is actually quite 
um, big, it's bigger than our like average size, say, cola bottles. And I also got this blue raspberry one, so I'm super excited to try this out. Charlie did actually buy me one thing, this was after I bought everything. It's like this um, Cadbury's chocolate wafer thing, and he got one for himself as well, so. Yep, I love Cadbury's chocolate. Last thing I got in candy ink were these sweets. I think they're American sweets. So these are called Now and Later. And these are like um, chewy sweets with like a hard like outside layer, I'm guessing. And um, these are the sour ones because I love sour sweets. So lastly, I have some stuff from Superdrug. So let me go through the items that Charlie got me first. So Charlie got me some face mask. Um, I believe it was like uh, free for the price of two. And I've started getting back into face mask again recently. I try and use at least one every single week. And I've wanted to try out one of these um, fabric ones for a little while, but they're normally quite pricey. And there's some in Primark, but they're like three pounds and I'm not paying three pound for one face mask. So one of them is just a nourishing one and the other one is a revitalizing one. So I'm super excited to, to try these out. So I picked up a new mascara because um, I already have a few mascaras, but I thought I would get myself another one because I really like them and the ones that I love using are running out and I think mascaras only last about six months or something like that. So I thought I would go ahead and try this one. This is the Maybelline New York Lash Sensational. I don't even know how much this was but um, the three items that I picked up, I think they came up to like £22 and it was free for the price of two. So I decided to pick up a foundation. I don't know if this is even the right colour um, because I'm still sort of new to makeup. Um, I'm still sort of experimenting with which foundations I like and which ones I don't like. Even though I think I've already sort of figured that out. Um, I thought I would try something a little bit different. I decided to get the Maybelline Dream Satin Liquid. I'm super excited to try this out. I got this in the shade sandalwood beige i think that's what it's called um there was quite a few brown shades but i decided to go for this one hopefully it's not too dark i do have the maybelline dream matte mousse that's what i have on at the moment and i absolutely love it the last item i got was a primer because um i have quite a few primers now i didn't used to use primers and then all of a sudden i've got like six or seven um a lot of the primers i have don't actually work that's why i have so many of them so i got this elf one i don't know if it's any good um i've never even tried elf products before but i've heard a lot of people talking about this brand and they had a makeup counter and they had quite a few interesting products, but I was just on a hunt for a face primer. This is a mineral infused face primer. There was like 10 different ones. There was like a green one and like a shimmery one and like all sorts of different colors. But I just went for the clear one and it comes in this really nice like bottle as well. So I'm super excited to try this out. But that was everything that I got on Saturday. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I absolutely love filming hauls. So just, I don't know why I like filming hauls and I like what watching hauls i just love shopping um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below um let me know if you're actually enjoying my vlogs so if you want to follow me on instagram or check out my hamsters instagram then i'll have them linked down below in the description so i'll see you guys in my next video so bye for now